I have the Samsung Galaxy A14 and I'll be showing you how to add or remove the wireless debugging shortcut from the quick settings panel or the quick settings area. So currently I don't have it so I'll be showing you how to add it there and then also after that I'll show you how to remove it. So to be able to add that wireless debugging icon there you need to go inside developer options. So go to settings and then on the main settings page, scroll down to the bottom of the screen to see developer options. If you don't see developer options there, then you first of all have to enable developer options. So go to about phone and then go to software information and then go to build number and tap on that seven times. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's going to ask for your password, pin or pattern. So just provide that. And then now it's going to turn on developer mode, okay? So now if you can go back to the main settings page, there should be an option called developer options right below about phone. So tap on that and that takes you inside developer options. Now it's inside here that you want to scroll a little and look for quick settings developer tiles, okay? Tap on that and then you should see the wireless debugging option enable and as soon as you enable that if you now scroll to the quick settings you shall see the wireless debugging shortcut there okay so from here you can turn it on or turn it off okay to remove that wireless debugging shortcut just follow the steps i've just shown you until you land on this page and turn this feature or that particular setting off so that's basically how to enable and how to remove that wireless debugging shortcut from the quick settings of your Galaxy A14. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.